Lisa Loney and I'm the Carolinier at St. Thomas Church White Marsh. Where I am right now is about 50 feet up in the air in the playing cabin of our beautiful Carillon instrument. Right above my head is about 18,000 pounds worth of bronze. What I'm going to do for you today is give you a very fast tower tour, particularly helpful and maybe uh, entertaining for those people who can't always make the climb when we do regular tower tours. The Carillon at St. Thomas has 48 bells, the largest of which, called the Bordon, is 3,300 pounds. The smallest itty bitty guy is about 24 pounds. We have four octaves arranged like a piano. These are your white keys and these are your black keys. And for those of you who play piano, this is middle C for us. So we have one, two, three, four octaves. Also here at St. Thomas, we have the ability to uh, broadcast the sound inside the sanctuary, and that's what you hear on Sunday mornings. During our summer concert series, we couple the broadcast in the sanctuary audio with video so that the audience can watch us play exactly what I was doing a moment ago. This is a completely manual instrument. There's no electronics or pneumatics in, at all involved. When you want to play loud, you play loud. When you want to play soft, you play soft. Once the bells are tuned in the foundry, they do not go out of tune. The only adjustments I make is simply to the length of this rod right here, which is stainless steel and will expand and constrict with the weather. So if the clapper rides too close to the lip of the bell, it sounds something like this. Kind of like a hammer against a piece of metal. But when I lengthen this 30 seconds of an inch, I get what I want. So now we're going to go into a place that the tourists can't go, only myself and the technician, and that's up inside the belfry. So let's go up. the wonderful uh, inside of the belfry of the Carolina St. Thomas. This is our largest bell, again called the Borden. This is uh, 3,300 pounds. And if you look up inside, we can see the clapper. And this is what I activate from that console below. The clapper is hung offset. It's not hung in the middle. And there's only about an inch or two from the lip of the bell. This clapper probably weighs about 200 pounds. And that's what we're ringing. You'll see this row of wires. Each of these wires corresponds to one clapper and also to one baton on the console. This is what I was talking about before. If this expands or constricts, it affects that uh, clapper and how far away it rings from the bell. So if we take a look at these two bells right in front. are not moving. We call that hanging dead. They're uh, bolted to the steel uh, superstructure here in the belfry. So thank you for coming on our mini Carillon tour. Watch your emails and church bulletin announcements for other pop-up Carillon tours throughout the summer. And don't forget, Tuesdays at 7 o'clock, our summer concert series continues. We'll see you around the tower.